Eh, creo que sí, teacher. Y en otras ocasiones. Very good. Bueno, ya les comparto acá en el chat el... Thanks, thanks. Yes, yes, ok, excellent. You already know the platform, that's the idea, perfect. Open, open Kahoot, and in some minutes, I'm going to share the code. Give me some minutes, and then I'm going to share the code to you. Teacher, me piden un pin. Ya te lo comparto. One second, please. I am here looking for the code, the pin, yes. Mientras tanto, do you have any question about the zero, the first, or the second conditional? Or is totally clear the grammar topic? I guess that no. I suppose that you are very clear. Very good. Okay, one minute. I'm opening my Kahoot because I have many activities there to practice. So I need to see the correct code. Okay, well, listo, ya se los voy a enviar por acá. Ver perfil. Conditionals. Okay, I'm going to share my screen. Kahoot, share. Can you see my screen, guys? Can you see my Kahoot page? Yes, teacher. Okay, yes, it's loading. A little of patience, please. A little of patience because the internet is a little slow, but it's loading, it's loading the, the pin. Almost ready, almost ready. Some seconds more. Mm. It's very slow. I need that for this game, you prepare your screenshot about the information for zero and for first and for second conditionals. It's important because there you can identify the characteristic for each one and differentiate them. So that, that information is very useful for that. And I guess that you already have ad advanced in your in your three paragraph essay, yes. You already use the conditionals for the three paragraph essay. Let's see the chat, I think that is, okay. 
Okay, Adriana, no problem. Yes, the internet connection is a little bad. How many participants we are here today? It's important for the Kahoot game. Okay, very good. We are 20 participants. It continues loading. So sorry, I don't know. It's my internet or this. The same thing happened to me in the last class. It was loading and loading like for three minutes. So let's wait a little of patience, please. If you have any question about the say about the use of the conditionals in your in your homework, you can tell me, OK? Well. Oh, here we have the classic mode. Let's start. The pin is. I'm going to repeat it. Seven, nine, seven, one, five, five, nine. Victor Mal, very good. You are already in the game. Marian Barreto, very good. Excellent, Ingrid Diego. Okay, that's great. We are 20 participants, so I want to see 20 names here. We are four so far. Cristian Contreras, I think that you participated in the last class. Very good. Adriana, excellent, Miguel, excellent, we are seven. I want to see 20 participants. Diego, very good. At 35, eight, we're gonna start. At eight and 35, so let's wait three minutes. And we start. We are eight participants, but in the teams, we are 20. I want to see 20 people here. Continue being eight, but we are twenty. I want to see twenty names. What happens with the rest of students? We are 18 so far. So, what happens with Majeli or Dana, Diana, Jimena, Jorge, Nina, Marcela participating in the gameplay? Remember the pin: seven, nine, seven, one, five. Five, nine. Very good, Dana. Excellent. That's great. Okay, very good. You need to put your name, not the code. <laughs> Click, uh, type your name, not the code. Your name, please. Okay, are you ready, guys? Okay, we are ten. Okay, I think that it's time to start. Let's start.
conditionals. Will you be available if I go now? This is a question. What is the conditional? Will you be available if I go now? Three, two, one, zero. Okay. Oh my God. The first conditional. Yes, it's correct. Is the first conditional because we are using the future with will and the verb in the condition in present simple. This is not the second conditional because the second conditional has other characteristics in the verbs and is not zero conditional because zero conditional has other characteristics that you need to see in the screenshot that you took for this activity. Let's see who is first. Very excellent, very good, very good, Victor and Christian, that's great. Next. If I want the lottery, I do travel around the world. What's the condition on there? First, second, zero, first. If I want the lottery, I would travel around the world. Want, no es un auxiliar, es ganar. In past, one. If I want the lottery, I would travel around the world. Very good. Is second conditional because the verb is in past and the result is using the future particle good. It's not the third conditional because in this class we are not focused on third conditional. However, the third conditional is with the participle form and in this sentence is, is in the participle form. And is not the, this is not the zero conditional because the zero conditional is using the both parts in, pre, in present simple. Very good students, you are so intelligent. Let's see the next. I wear a jacket if it rains. This is very easy. This is not nothing difficult. I wear a jacket if it rains. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. What's the conditional? The conditional is zero conditional. Oh my goodness, this is very easy, but you get, you got confused with first conditional. You need to see, you need to practice so the differences between first conditional and zero conditional because the most of you answered incorrectly, incorrectly so. Is zero conditional because we are using both the condition and the result with present simple. Okay, let's see. Very good, Christian. That's great. Okay, let's continue. The next, and I think that is this is the final one because the time is almost ready. Okay, which is the sentence with second condition? You need to choose the sentence in second conditional. Analyze the sentence. Okay. Okay. If I marry tomorrow, I wouldn't invite you. The second conditional. Remember, the verb of the condition in past and the result with the particle in future good. Okay. The others are incorrect because they doesn't allow, they doesn't belong to second condition. Let's see the last one. Very good, perfect. Let's see the last one, which is the sentence with first condition. First condition. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Only two people asserted, and the other three, uh, five people were wrong. Because the first conditional is characterized by using the future, the future simple, the future with the particle will for real situations, for probably situations, and the result is in present simple. Yeah, so I will get late if I don't hurry. Very good. The red color is not possible because the red color is using past. So if I had a car, I could pick her up. ¿Cuál sería el condicional de esa? If I had a car, I could pick her up. En pasado. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes, very good. Is the second conditional porque el verbo está en pasado y el resultado me lo da con el good. En, en futuro, una, un, una situación imaginaria o menos probable que suceda. Y el, el eh, blue color is Susan is sick. She is in the hospital. So, in this case, we don't have condition. Yes, but. Okay, could be could be zero conditional, but this is not a conditional form because this is this doesn't contain this. No, it's not future, it's present. It's present y pertenecería al cero condicional. Pero como no estamos utilizando la cláusula, if if Susan is sick, she is in the hospital or something like that. But in this case, could be zero conditional. Very good, let's see, let's finish. Okay, congratulations. I think he's Christine Contreras. The next is Victor Manuel and finally Mayerly. Very good, you are very intelligent guys. Everybody of you are very, very, very intelligent. Okay, so this is all for this class students. Thank you for your participation.